Hey there, it's Eric Evanstead with bootstrapbizgrowth.com and in this video, I'm gonna show you a really cool way to get your computer to run faster and specifically to get your internet browsers to run a little bit faster. And that's gonna help you get more done. It's gonna limit frustrations that you feel when you uh, are waiting on a page to load. I know I get really frustrated when I'm waiting too long and it kind of takes me back to those old dial-up days. But this is really gonna help speed up your internet and it's gonna be especially helpful for those of you that have a ton of tabs open at any given time. I know if you're like me, you have probably four different Chrome browser windows open, and each one probably has 10 different tabs. That's just the way I do things. That's how I keep things organized. A lot of times I come across articles that I think might be helpful for my own business or um, for my students' businesses, but I don't have time to read it at that moment. And so I just open up a new tab and I save it there so that I can come back to it later. Or maybe you have a bunch of different tools that you run. So maybe you have uh, your email marketing system that's always open so you can easily get in there and send emails or create new automations. Maybe you have all your different social media pages open, your website is open, and you need easy access to all of those. But what happens when you have all those tabs open is it slows down your computer a lot because it takes a lot of processing power. So I'm gonna show you a few different tools that are gonna allow you to keep all those tabs open for your convenience, but it's gonna help speed up your computer. And it may not seem like it's all that important, but trust me, it's gonna speed up your computer enough to where you're gonna notice it. And these tools are free. You don't have to do anything to use them. You just set them up once and they're good to go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk you through these three different tools. These are all free Chrome extensions. So they're specific to the Google Chrome browser. I believe all these extensions are also available with Firefox and possibly other browsers. I'm not really sure. It's worth looking into because these have made a big difference for me and I think they're going to make a big difference for you as well. So I'm going to share my screen right now and kind of just show you around, show you these three different tools and how I use them. So right now, here we are. So this is the first one. It's called the Great Suspender. And what this does is it suspends tabs that have been open for, I think, 15 or 20 minutes without being used. So I'll show you an example here. This is a tab. This is for my online course that I have. And this is the administrative page. So I always have this open so I can just see my sales and track everything and track my affiliates. But when it's open, it takes up a lot of processing speed. So what this does is it suspends my tab and it looks like this. So when it's suspended, it's not using up as much of that processing speed, which helps speed up my computer and my browser experience. And then as soon as I wanna use it, I just come to this tab, I click on it and it reloads it and now I can use it again. So it just takes a second and now it's up and running again and it's fully functional. So here's another one. This was an article that I wanted to read, but I didn't have time at the, at the moment that I found it to read it. And so it's been sitting here for a little bit. Maybe now I wanna come in and read it and see what's going on. So I click that and there we go. Now here's this article that I can go in and read again. And again, if I'm not active on this tab for another uh, 20 or 30 minutes, it's gonna get suspended again, which is again gonna free up my computer space. So this is a really handy one that I just love. Um, another one that I really love is called OneTab. And this one's pretty similar. It just functions a little bit differently. And I just recently got this one um, and I'll show you how to use it. I would probably select either the Great Suspender or One Tab. I'm still deciding which one that I like more, but I think they both serve the same purpose, but in a unique way. So I'll show you how this one works. This is One Tab right here. And what happens is you have this little Chrome extension icon up here. This is the One Tab Chrome extension icon. And when I click on this, it's gonna move all of those five tabs I just had open into a single tab. So now I have each of these here, and if I want to restore all of them, I can do that. And now I have all my tabs back, okay? And then I'll do that again. Now it shrinks it down to one tab. When I click that, this really limits that processing power, which again is gonna speed up your computer I could also just click on one. So maybe I just want to open up one of these tabs. I can do that. So now that one is available and these four are still um, shrunk down and saving space. So that works really well. So this is one that I could see myself using a lot more. 
I do really like how it just shrinks it and declutters everything as compared to, I'll show you my other screen here. I have all these tabs on my other browser window and this is just a little bit overwhelming for me. And so that is something I really like about this one tab option is that it just really shrinks down your view. It allows you to get stuff done. So if I was just working on one task, maybe I was writing a new blog post, I could do that without having the distractions of all these different tabs. So I really do like that about one tab and it could cause me to switch over from the great suspender. Again, I'm still playing with this one, so stay tuned. I'll let you know which one I decide to use uh, full time, but I have been using the great suspender for years now, probably three or four years. I can tell you that that one works very well. So it's really around personal preference is how I would decide if I were you. I would try them both out, see which one you like better. Um, and then I wanna show you one other tool that I really like, and this is, not so much to speed up your computer, but it is related because it's for tabs people. So I don't know about you, but if you ever, if your computer ever restarts on you or all of a sudden maybe Chrome crashes and you had say four windows and those 10 tabs on each window, that can be devastating when you lose all those 40 different tabs or 30 different tabs. That's a lot of information that you lost that you were planning on going back to. And it can take a lot a lot of time to go back in, figure out what websites you were on, uh, open them all up, sign back into all those pages. That can take a long time. So this is a tool that prevents that. So if your browser ever crashes or your computer restarts, Tabs Outliner it's called, this is gonna open up all those tabs back up for you. So I'll show you what this looks like. I'm gonna come into here and here's Tabs Outliner icon. This is a, again another free Chrome extension. If I click on this, it opens up Tabs Outliner. And within here, it has all of my different tabs going back with history. So these are tabs, as you can see here, Windows crashed. So these were all the tabs that were open at that time. So I could go back in here months later and open up old tabs. And as you can see down here, it has all my current tabs open. So these ones are in blue text. These are all my current tabs that I have open. So I can come back in here if my Chrome were to crash right now, I could come back into here and open all these up, just click on them once and they would open back up so that I could resume whatever I was doing. So this is a really great insurance policy, we'll call it for tabs users. And I love this one. I can say, tell you, and I can tell you that it saved me big time over the years. So I'd really recommend this Chrome extension to all you tab enthusiasts like myself. Those are the three tools I recommend. Again, they're gonna speed up your computer. They're gonna give you some insurance policies. These are specifically for all of you that use tabs all the time throughout the day uh, to help you run your business. And I do hope this is valuable. I recommend that you try at least two of these. Try one of the ones that speeds up your computer and then everybody should get this tabs outliner one um, just to, for that insurance policy. And if it has been helpful, share this with anybody else that you know that is a tabs person. Give us a thumbs up down below. Write us a comment if you have other tools that you use to speed up your computer experience. And, uh, and lastly, I would love it if you would subscribe to our YouTube channel. We have tons of videos like this to help you uh, increase your productivity, to help you with affordable marketing tactics and strategies, to help you outsource and free up more time to focus on more important tasks that grow your business. So I do hope that you subscribe to our channel. We are producing tons of content. We're coming out with new videos every single day, and I think it's gonna add a ton of value and help you grow your business. So I love it. Again, if you would just subscribe, hit the big red button down below. And then I just wanna say thanks for stopping by and watching this video, and we'll see you next time.